In this video, we are going to talk about the types of acne. So first of all, we need to understand that there are two types of acne. The one is inflammatory and the other is non-inflammatory. So the first is microcomedones, then comes whiteheads that are also called closed comedones, then comes blackheads that are also called open comedones. These three are non-inflammatory type of acne. Then comes towards the inflammatory type of acne. It starts from papules, then comes pustules, then cyst, and then the last is nodules. So let's just have an overview of microcomedones. Microcomedones are the smallest of all acne blemishes. These comedones are invisible to the naked eye. They are like the seeds from which larger comedones can emerge. As you can see in the picture that there are some microcomedones that may pop up later. Now comes two words, whiteheads that are also called closed comedones. A whitehead is a type of acne that forms when dead skin cells, oil and bacteria become trapped within one of your pores. So it just leads to whiteheads. Whiteheads could be like this. As you can see in the picture, they are like very small type of pimple. Let's just now move towards blackheads. Blackheads are also called open comedones. They are open bumps on the skin that fills with excess oil and dead skin. They look as if dirt is in the bump. They basically are present on the nose and they are like this, like black dots on the skin as you can see in the picture. Now we will discuss about papules. So papule is a raised area of skin tissue that's less than one centimeter around. A papule can have distinct or indistinct borders. As you can see in the picture, papule is like a large pimple, but not that much large because it is just less than one centimeter. Papules occur when the clogging pores cause a hair follicle to become inflamed. When this happens, the body's immune system sends white blood cells to fight the infection. That is why they look like a pus field. Now let's just talk about pustules. Pustule is a big bulging patch of skin that's full of yellowish fluid called pus. It's basically a big pimple. You can see the white pus inside the pimple. Now discuss about cystic acne that's very severe type of acne. Cystic acne is a type of inflammatory acne that causes painful pus with pimple to form deep under the skin. Cystic acne is the most severe type of acne. As you can see in the picture, the boy has a lot of large pimples on his skin and they are like really painful. If you have any type of pimple that is painful, you must be aware of that, that it might be cystic acne. Now let's just talk about nodules. So nodules acne is characterized by hard, painful acne lesions deep under the skin. It often affects the face, chest or back. Unlike regular pimples that often heal within a few days, acne nodules may last for weeks or months sometimes. So this type of acne is basically nodules when you have large pimples on your face, neck or on your back. So let's just have a review of type of acne you have. You can recognize it after watching the whole video.